left Glossop this morning after my run, just a nice drive northeast. Lovely day, lovely weather. Stopped in this little riverside car park. Had a walk around here. And um, made myself some grilled cheese sandwiches and some coffee. And I'm gonna get back on the road now. Day three on the road done. It's Monday morning. Just got up. Well, I didn't just get up. I um, I parked up last night in the outskirts of Leeds. Nice car park. Quiet little corner. I just had bread, cheese and mayonnaise for dinner. You've got to know the truth about these things. And um, I woke up this morning, had a nice run, lovely run actually, along the river, through Leeds city centre and up into the university, um, which was completely dead. And then just got back here, had a wash, shower out the back here, and um, cleaned the car. And now I'm just going into town, uh, have a coffee, have some lunch. Have you got somewhere I can plug my laptop in? Uh, yes. Are you planning on working for an extended period of time? Or? About an hour or two, maybe? Okay, yeah. So we, we, when it works, we've got plugs and we've got Wi Fi. Yeah. Um, and your first half an hour of Wi Fi is free, but then there's a minimum spend from then onwards. Okay, cool, yeah. So it's a £5 pound minimum spend, and you pay up front, and then you just eat into that with food and drink. So Perfect. Is that, is that Sounds good, okay? yeah. So I've just pulled into Ilkley. Looks like a nice little town. My mum just said that uh, she used to bring my gran here when she lived in Leeds. And I've had a look on my trail app and there's loads of trails uh, towards the north of Ilkley, across Ilkley Moor. So I'll just spend the rest of the afternoon around here, I think. Do need a poo. I, unfortunately, I couldn't summon it when I was at the cafe earlier. So, I might need to go and take a flop on the moor, which uh, has a nice ring to it, I suppose. The moor plopper. Just gonna stop here for this evening. I'm gonna search for a little spot that's the most level and the most out of the eye line. So this is my spot for the evening. The car isn't hidden but this is so quiet and secluded out here. 
Um, there's been no car on this road for a good half an hour. Everyone's at home. No one's using this little turny bit this evening. So I've got the doors open and uh, I don't think I've ever been anywhere this quiet before. It is deathly silent out there. A pair of these type of sandals is uh, absolutely essential. They can just slip on and off, even in muddy conditions. I can just quickly, without any fuss, enter and exit the vehicle. It's only half seven and uh, it is very secluded out here. I am extremely confident that I will not be disturbed this evening. And uh, if I am, well, no one's going to walk their dogs around here at this time. The only chance is if someone's driving past and calls the police that there's a uh, a small black car in the middle of the moors half an hour from any house or shop and they would come here they would um they would probably knock on the window and uh, i would explain that i'm just driving to scotland it was a bit muggy and misty on the moors so i just decided to pull over and uh, make some fajitas So here we are then, veggie fajitas. I've got green beans, loads of little aubergines, mushrooms, vegan sausage, which is um, a good product actually. Very meaty, especially for this purpose. And um, yeah, it um, doesn't have any of the water of a normal sausage. And it's been in the back of my car for four days and it's still pretty fresh, so. Tomato for when these are on. And um, yeah, should be a pretty straightforward dish. I've got my um, tortillas over here. Dump these on. I've cracked in a few eggs, um, not because I think it's a particularly great idea, but I bought these eggs on a walk the other day. I thought it'd be a cool thing to do, fresh farm eggs, but it's hard to know when to use them. So I don't think it's a great idea, but you know, we'll see. Just like that. Um, some grated cheese. That definitely does it. Four G on mobile hotspot, unlimited data for £20 a month and uh, just watching Premier League on the moors 